Okay, so from a cashless society to unmanned stores and waiterless restaurants to mobile commerce beyond our imagination, clearly this is not how most Americans perceive China. And these are not stories you typically see reported in the mainstream press. However, this is the reality in China today. But hold on, you might be saying to yourself, I thought this was a communist country. This doesn't sound like communism to me. Well, as Jim Rogers said earlier, California and Massachusetts are probably more communist than China. And the truth is, while the Chinese call themselves communists, they are actually among the best capitalists on earth. And this is part of what's caused such a radical distortion between perception and reality in China today. China isn't a communist country anymore. It's not a Marxist uh, communist regime like it was under Mao Zedong. Uh, it has advanced much more into what you might call a form of autocratic capitalism. It's still a dictatorship, it's still an autocracy, it's not a true democracy by any means, but think about it, most of the economy is now run by private sector interests, by private companies who are doing their own thing, investing, doing what they want to do. Uh, families can pretty much live where they choose these days, they can get educated the way they want, they can own their own home, they can invest in stock markets, invest in all sorts of products, still a lot of restrictions, nowhere near as free as it is in the West perhaps, but it's certainly not a communist country in the way that uh, Marxism says that all resources must be owned by the state. That is not the case in China anymore. I mean, this is a country where since 1978, 1980, when Deng Xiaoping started the open-door policy, a country where GDP growth has skyrocketed, where life expectancy has skyrocketed, where quality of life skyrocketed. Everything has gone up, up, up. This is an economic miracle. You know, those are measurable facts in a communist country brought about by capitalism. It's almost ridiculous to call China a communism country because the government is the biggest capitalist in the world. I never look at China as, as a communist nation. I, I don't even use, ever use the word. Um, you, know, we, you know, China is very capitalistic, okay? You, you, there's a middle class forming there. You have uh, hope, I go back to the word hope, um, that you, you can be you know, uh, you know, uh, low income and, and become a billionaire. 